The other day I was travelling in a tube train and I saw a little man trying to read his newspaper. I want you to imagine that this is the little man sitting in the train, that it is empty, that more and more people start coming in, making his reading quite impossible. Now please just imagine these people coming in left, right and in front. Robert Harbin, when you see him do the torn and restored newspaper, it's such a, a great performance because he has set up the motivation for his work. The first book I ever wrote in 1946 I put favorite magician Robert Harbin. I never saw any reason to change that. He was a South African, and Harbin thought, ate, smoked, drank magic from start to finish. And so he read his news. But the amazing part was the way in which he opened it out in the ordinary way. He was probably...